I'm Rod Borden, the Director of Produce at Lunds & Byerly's. At Lunds & Byerly's, we're really, really proud of our produce departments, the fruits and vegetables that we sell, and all the things that go on behind the scenes to make sure that we get the freshest, highest quality product for our customers. We don't work with produce distributors. We work directly with the growers. We have our own distribution center. That gives us the ability to work directly with the grower. Besides the growers we deal with out in California, in Florida, in Texas, we also deal with a lot of growers right here in Minnesota. The Lunds family was one of the first retailers that actually dealt with the Minnesota farmer's market. A lot of times, we, either our buyers or I fly out there, and we actually sometimes meet the owner. We look at the fruit we potentially could have in the stores. Um, so a lot of that relationship, and when we get to meet the grower like that, we can actually build this bond between the, they, we know their expectations, they know our expectations of what fruit we want to sell for them. They know we handle the product correctly. The distribution center is a key differentiator for us. Our ability to take the product from the farm to our distribution center to the retail and maintain the quality um, gives us the ability to make sure that our customers are getting the freshest, highest quality produce possible. I'm Christy Hart and I am the produce category specialist here at Lunds and Byerly's. So when we start our day here, we begin with checking all of the fruits and vegetables in our produce department for spoilage. We're keeping in mind that a lot of the fruit is still good to eat. If it is still good to eat, we donate it to a Second Harvest and they connect us with a local food shelf. Any product that comes from the produce department that doesn't meet the food shelf requirements will go to local farmers and they will use it to feed their cattle. So here at Lunds and Byerly's, we practice what we call our brand of merchandising. It has to do with different standards and expectations we have for all of our displays. For example, a pear. If you put a pear by a very popular apple, you're gonna have people walk up to those apples that they know are there, they'll see the pear, and you know what, they may try it. It may be the best pear they've ever had. And that's all part of the experience and the intent is to get people to see and experience new fruits and vegetables. My most favorite part of the day is getting to help people, seeing customers come in every day, getting to chat with them, building that personal relationship uh, that is unique to our company. Mm -hmm.